Hey, good afternoon guys. Greg Thornhill with Boaters World of Lake Placid, Florida. Today we're on beautiful Lake June and I'm going to walk you through the Roballo 270. Let's talk about the specs of this boat. This is a 27 and a half foot boat. It is a 9 foot 6 inch beam. It's 180 gallon fuel capacity and 23 degree dead rise, 21 inch draft. The boat's just incredible. We've set it up with twin 250 Yamahas. We did have them painted so it matches the boat beautifully. This is a full haul steel blue boat and it's absolutely gorgeous. One of the nice features that I like start right away with the fact that we have an easy access panel, dual battery switches, which makes it real nice. Back here, one of the nice features about this boat is everybody's got to walk into the splash well to walk across. Here we have a nice little pad and it makes it real easy to just walk across. Also have the rod holders in the back and they're fixed as well as your rocket launchers on top. Plenty of room for all of your rods and stuff. And of course you've got the gunnels that hold rods as well. We have a 30 gallon live well on this boat and it's insulated. So Roballo had it insulated, so you can use it as a cooler, but also for your bait, and it'll stay alive and stay fresh and stay cool. Another feature that's real nice is you've got the jump seat. This thing just pops right out. It allows you to sit down and enjoy yourself. We have another seat right next to me, and it's nice. I can talk with my family and enjoy the day. You have a huge access panel. I've got my chargers, my pumps, and everything, absolutely everything I can get to. We have a store away for the ladder for the tuna door, which makes it real nice. It's tucked away, out of sight, out of mind, unless you need it. Another feature here is on this back. I like this because I can pop this up, fold it away, and then here, I've got another live well. Down here, we've got 50 gallon fish storage. And I'll tell you, it's a fish box. You can use it for drinks or you can use it for your catch. It is fully insulated and I've got it on both sides on the floor. I love how we have the bolster that goes from the back all the way to the front of the boat. And another thing that's real cool is this, this tow kick. This thing here, this allows you to fish and I can really sit here and, and get into some fish and not worry about falling over the boat. Another cool feature with Roballo is they have it to where you can walk around the entire boat. This is about 11 inch gunnel and there's nothing obstructing you. What we did here is we did the Simrad 12 inch. We had it installed from the manufacturer so you get a real clean finish you know it's real hard to get that unless you're getting it from the manufacturer another thing that's real nice is i've got my throttle here and right here is my trim tabs easy access to my fingers and i can just pull the throttle up and back and, and control those another nice feature is we did put autopilot we nema network the autopilot as well as the stereo so everything sits on these screens right here which is really nice. Now, what Roballo has done is they have found something that is probably gonna be, I would say, the best in the industry. What makes this really nice is it's silicone. It's soft to the touch, but it's mildew resistant as well as stain resistant, and it's just incredible. Beautiful seating with a backrest. This is real nice. You notice I didn't have to take the cushion off. This is an insulated box. You can use it for fish. You can use it for a cooler. And what they decided to do was, this year they went with the, um, the Yeti plug. So if I want just a little bit of the water out, I can do that and not ruin everything. I just lose it, which is a nice, nice feature. Another thing that I want to show you is look how that stayed up. The gas assist shock is absolutely incredible. So we can be on the water and rocking. This thing's going to stay up. This is on the Roballo boats. No more side entry. This opens up. 22 inches wide. It's got a porcelain toilet as well as storage for the table that I can also make into a bow deck. I can put a table here. I've got a small arm that comes up and I can entertain my family and we can have lunch. I can also take that table and drop it down to a deck and then I can have this whole thing cushioned out or I can have it set up for fishing. So what I'm going to do now is being that we're on the lake, we can run this boat. 